what's going on everybody? My name's Copa Killjoy and to kill your boredom brings me a lot of joy. Welcome to Cam Camp Episode 3, Scouts Dishonor. So our last episode we saw that they got a new mascot which was the platypus and it was just fucking hysterical, especially towards the end when they all start screaming pussy and the old mascot just kept dying. And, you know, again, I'm hooked on the show. I'm loving everything. I'm loving the swearing from the little kids. I'm loving all the violence. It's just awesome. And it makes me wonder why not all camps can be more like this. So, um, as always, guys, you remember, on uh, uh, July coming up, we're going to be doing a Loot Crate giveaway once we get it in. Uh, their theme for the next month is Bob's Burgers or Animation Domination, which is uh, what you normally see on uh, Adult Swim or Fox. So it's Bob Burgers, uh, Rick and Morty. Or maybe it's just Bob Burgers, I don't know, I only read the description, like, very brief. So, uh, if you want a chance to win something from that, uh, just remember, always just hit the subscribe button, leave us a like. And when we do choose you, just to let us know what prize you would like. Uh, as always, we're, if we don't just choose one, if we choose multitudes, that means we're going to choose a multitude of people to have a chance to win. Uh, and when we do contact you, just remember, uh, we'll let you know that you won. And just send us a P.O. box uh, to let us know where to send it to. Uh, and hopefully... Uh, when you when we do message you guys, you guys respond back to us quickly because uh, if, if you guys don't, unfortunately, there's going to be a time limit. If you guys don't respond back to us uh, within a week's time, uh, then we're going to have to move on to a uh, uh, someone else to be chosen. Um, so, but a week should be long enough, and you know, who doesn't want free shit? <laughs> so, uh, without further ado, let's jump into some more Cam Camp. I'm really enjoying the series so far. Um, I'm thinking about continuing Red vs. Blue from where I left off at when I watched it back in the Marine Corps. I'm um, still debating on that yet. Uh, there's other videos I would like to try to work on, but if you guys want to see that, let me know and I'll definitely do it for you. Uh, but without further ado, let's jump into some more fucking Camp Camp. Camp Beam! Ah, another wonderful day at Camp okay. Campbell. All that's left to do now is recharge with a full eight hours of lying in bed, awake, waiting for tomorrow. You fucking weirdo. All right, guys, our first attempt to bust out of this godforsaken hellhole didn't work. But tonight's gonna be different because we have a secret weapon. Billy Nixil. Holy shit. Call me Snake. <laughs> he's ex Wood Scouts, and he's one of the best. Isn't that right? Jesus, it's like a combination of Solid got Snake my rescue badge in two <laughs> and uh, got my wooden survival in one. Uh, from That's Escape amazing. from New York, what was his name? I never had a choice. I can't remember his the name. The Wood Scouts Fuck. are some of the most intense militant campers on Lake Lilac. Billy here escaped. And why is he helping us? I'm not doing this for you. I made a vow. Very serious, motherfucker. Well, okay, let's get in the boat. <laughs> so what are you gonna do on the outside? Probably live with the animals. Try and get raised by wolves. Maybe work my way up to Alba. These two make an awesome couple. I guess just what picture them getting together. I think I'll go to my dad's house and tell him mom sent me to an abusive summer camp. <laughs> I tend to like him more, <laughs> and she'll try to buy back my love. That's really dark, Neil. How about you, Max? Max? Billy, where are you taking oh, us? Oh, God. Shortcut. Shortcuts are never good in any situation. Property of the woods, yes. <gasps> oh! Jesus Christ! What the fuck? Uh, are you taking them hostage? Yeah, what gives? No girls alive! <laughs> Nikki! <Punk. laughs> Neil, quick, grab his... Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> You never left them, did you, Billy? No. I made a vow to show others the glory of the Wood Scouts, and I told you to call me Snake. <laughs> oh, there's a place I know that's tucked away, a place where you and I can stay, where we can go to laugh and play. This fucking song, man. I know it sounds hard to believe, but guys and gals, it's true. I don't know if I want to edit this out of my videos for now, but I think this kind of like gets me going for Camp Camp. I'm gonna have to learn the lyrics to this. <laughs> oh, Kurt Russell, that's the name of the guy. From Escape from LA and Escape from New York. <laughs> Wake up! Who was? Nikki? Yep. What am I wearing? Where are we? Where happiness goes to die. Oh my god. Is that? Oh, Girl Scouts. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guys. You know them? 
Ew. Who is Oh, that's why he's wearing the headdress. Right, please. A flower scout always welcomes others with daintiness and respect. Flower scouts? <laughs> Holy shit. God, they're probably evil, aren't you they? You were a flower scout? Ugh, yeah. But they were totally boring, so I bailed. Ahem. <clears throat> It's so good to see you again, Nikki. And, um... Nancy! Nancy? Yes! It's, uh, it's spelled Billy Dom, it's French. Ooh, France. I'm Tabby with <laughs> two eyes. Welcome on, Nancy. <laughs> Our morning activities Nazi. are starting. It's not you saying you Nazi. You too, Nikki. Man, we really lucked out. Hey, Dark past. Max is okay? Why do you keep hitting me? And why is it only cloudy over your side of the lake? That's enough. <laughs> Don't want to over tenderize the new oh, meat. God. Who the hell are you? Cedar Scout, first class, Edward Pikeman, senior patrol leader of Wood Scout Troop 818. And it looks like you're our latest recruit. God, your face is gross. What? Oh, sorry. That just slipped out. Dude. Sorry. I know. <laughs> that was me. It really was. It's just, you were so close. Actually. Enough! <laughs> Enrollment into our organization has reached an all-time low, so we have no choice but to forcibly recruit new members into our program. Jesus. I mean, have you considered enrollment is low because you guys do things like kidnap other campers? Oh, we don't kidnap campers. That'd be immoral. That guy literally stabbed me in the back. No, he rescued you after you ran away from Camp Campbell. Remember? Uh. And now... We're going to make a wood scout out of you, Max. Prepare the ropes course! No! <laughs> Arts and crafts. <laughs> he fits right in. Oh my god. Sewing and embroidery. Nyatsi. BFF. Oh god. Mining your manners. <laughs> Consider yourself an honorary flower scout. We're gonna find out. Well, gonna, he's gonna be revealed. Thanks. I know it. This place is amazing. Air conditioning, indoor plumbing, free Wi-Fi. That's <laughs> actually a hotspot. Wow. <laughs> I mean, what did you think this place was like? A girl can't be expected to rough it in the cruel outdoors. Amen, sister. Hey guys, check it out. Feminist. Holy I'm shit. I'm Tim Timothy. Nikki, that's incredible. Yeah. <laughs> uh, huh? Nikki, gross. I probably has worms. What is wrong with you? But he brought gifts. <laughs> ah! <laughs> get away from her. What? Why? Can't you see? She's not normal. Nancy, that's me. I know you're new. But you have to see that Nikki's just not flower scouts. Say material. donut caboose. That's why we ran her out in the first place. You ran her out? Of course. It was for her own good. She's just so unladylike. She likes bugs and fighting and exercising for reasons other than sculpting the perfect body image. It's like if a boy were to come in here and try to do what we do. Whoa, 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 hold on. What the hell's that supposed to mean? Uh, hello, Nancy. Boys are supposed to be tough and rugged. And if they pee in you, you get pregnant. Whoa. Tabby, <laughs> sister told me. Jesus Look, Nancy, <laughs> Christ. That's just how the world works. Now, do you want to be socially outcast? Or do you want to go get ice cream? What are you going to do, buddy? Y'all are some ignorant fucking cunts. <laughs> <laughs> and the name's Neil. Let's get out of here, Neil. That's how you deal with feminism. Also, I'm keeping the Wi-Fi. Timothy away! <laughs> Damn, that's a strong ass fucking bird. He can pee in me anytime. Oh my god. Tabby, seriously, what the fuck? <laughs> Thanks for sticking up for me, Neil. Yeah, well, paradise isn't paradise without your friends. That was super gay. We just learned a lesson about stereotyping. Oh, right. Sorry. <laughs> Do you think Max learned any valuable lessons on his adventure? No. You know. Maybe I don't God hate second hell. Maybe I hate everything. <laughs> Alright, let's see the voice because those are some new voices. Oh, yeah, the usual. 
Dante. Dante Bosco's in this? No way! Holy shit, that's awesome! Also, uh, for those of you who don't know who uh, Dante Bosco is, uh, he did the voice for Zuko in uh, Avatar The Last Airbender. And uh, I believe he also did uh, voices for uh, Jake the Dragon uh, from Disney. And he was uh, Rufio in uh, the movie Hook with uh, Robin Williams. So, that was pretty cool. I did not know that. Alright guys, thanks for watching this episode. And also, uh, the kid... Uh, Billy Snake, or the Snake as he wanted to be called. Uh, the person who I thought he looked like was a combination of the actual Solid Snake uh, from Metal Gear Solid and uh, Kurt Russell's character uh, from Escape from New York and Escape from LA. I thought that was pretty cool. And I'm surprised that they got Dante Bosco on this because, uh, you know, I'm surprised they didn't catch on to that quicker, but, you know, that's the thing about voice acting. You can actually, you know, change your voices and, you know, sometimes you can never tell. But, again, I really enjoyed this episode. I'm enjoying this series so far. I can't get enough of it. Um, also, if you guys enjoyed watching this video, just as always, you know, like, share, and subscribe. It'll automatically, uh, well, subscribe, really. But it will uh, give you a chance to enter in for uh, a chance to win some more uh, stuff from our Loot Crate and Hockey Bento unboxing videos. Um, if you guys want to see me react to anything else, uh, I'm still thinking about doing uh, Continuing Red vs. Blue. I heard that the series got, you know, uh, not just better as far as animation goes, but also a more some, something on a more serious level as well. So I'm definitely going to have to check that out. Uh, but again, guys, uh, thanks for liking and subscribing uh, to my videos and to my channel. It really helps out. And we also got the Patreon uh, set up, and uh, we actually have a link for the Patreon in the YouTube banner, which is pretty cool. I didn't know you could do that, and I just, uh, I just learned that recently. And yes, I'm still learning a lot about YouTube. Uh, so again, thanks for everything, guys, and uh, just keep your notifications on. Uh, for the next video, right? Later. When the lights in the house crash out with the sound of respect and pride for each side, when the motherfuckers try to slide a rock and find out it's the turn of the times to keep it real. If you feel what the fucking deal is wrong, gunshot that will stop your motherfucking heart like bull with the edge of the room into the stage, start to shake and quake. I'm gonna motherfucking break this. Hell.